Now to the surge of migrants at our southern border. More than 4,000 migrant children are in U.S. custody, many of them in Texas tonight. The Biden administration is now facing pressure to address this problem. Our ABC 10 reporter Laura Acevedo went to local border officials to find out if they're noticing a similar surge here. Locally, Border Patrol says they haven't seen a surge of unaccompanied children in the same way that Texas had, but did share statistics that show a year-to-year -year increase in the number of migrants detained. Hundreds of migrant children are being housed inside these tents along the border after a reported 25% surge in border crossings by unaccompanied minors. The Department of Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas saying they are now bracing for more migrants at the border than at any time in the past 20 years. Do not come now. Um, give us the time to rebuild a system that was entirely dismantled in the prior administration. On CBP's website, their latest statistics show that in San Diego, there has been a year-to-year -year increase when comparing the month of February. CBP reports a 64% increase of unaccompanied minors, a 138% increase of single adults, and a 13% decrease in family units, saying there's been a, quote, steady but slow rise since April of last year. Local immigrant advocates say they don't consider it a surge. So it's not something that's particularly different from other years where there might be some differences could be in how migrants are responding to newer um, immigration policies put in place during the Trump administration. In an exclusive interview with ABC News's George Stephanopoulos, President Biden pressed on the issue. A lot of the migrants coming in saying they're coming in because you promised to make things better. It seems to be getting worse by the day. Was it a mistake not to anticipate this surge? Well, first of all, there was a surge the last two years in, in, in 19 and 20. There was a surge as well. Biden asking migrants not to come. I can say quite clearly, don't come. And what we're in the process of getting set up, don't leave your town or city or community. In a statement, Congressman Darrell Issa telling ABC 10 News the chaos at the border is not only a crisis, it was set in motion by the policies of the Biden administration. Our Border Patrol on the front lines is doing what it can, but the historic migrant surge in the San Diego region is real, and unless the White House begins to deal with its disaster, it will only get worse. Laura Acevedo, ABC 10 News.